Hi, this is Barbara Williams from just outside the San Francisco Bay Area, and I'm here today <laughs> with Promise. And Promise is, loves to lay on her bag, and that's a whole different story for today about why she loves to lay on her bag. And telling you that she's a miniature schnauzer and she's a solid black recessive gene miniature schnauzer is also for another day. But we are having puppies, not with her, but with another miniature schnauzer. But today I'm here to talk to you about grooming, and specifically about grooming a difficult dog. Now, in my opinion, right now, she looks a little dry hairish, you know, with dry hair. And so she's been really very sensitive about being combed. So a lot of people would stop combing because they're difficult to comb. But I, have, I do not own a part of this business, and I hope you can read that. <laughs> and here you go again. This is a Warren London pomegranate and acai hydrating butter for dogs. It's non-oily hydrating treatment for dog skin and coat. I make no money off of promoting this. <laughs> So what I do is that I'm using this for a couple different reasons. It can go in the coat um, after, it's a, it's a leave-in conditioner, so it can go in after they've been bathed and it can go in when um, they're still, uh, she's got some hair. <laughs> uh, they can go in when they're still wet also. Either way is fine, so here's my coat. And um, I tried the comb, and I tried the brush, and I had more difficulty with her screaming and crying over the brush. I tried the regular bristle brush. I tried the slicker brush. Um, I tried every brush out there. Excuse me. A little itch. <laughs> I tried every brush out there. And it wouldn't work. And so you'd think normally that a brush would work better uh, than a comb. But as you can see, this comb is working better. Now, she's also easier to comb through. She'll probably scream at some point. But a lot of people would go groom their dog less, not more. I groom more, and I didn't uh, tippy-toe around her. I groomed her like I would normally do my own hair and she had to kind of learn to get with it and so you can see that she has come a long ways now this is the big t part of the tooth of the comb so i suggest you get a comb that has the big teeth big space teeth and one that has the little space teeth now that i went through with the big space see then i go through with the little and make sure she's all combed out then, if for any reason, I still want to do a brush. But she's gotten a lot better. Some of these pulls I'm doing right now, she would have screamed her bloody head off. But I didn't let up. I groomed her more, not less. And that's a lot of mistakes that people make with dogs. Um, sometimes less is more, more is less. This time, more is more. So she did a lot more. Actually, more was less. More grooming, less screaming. So... Um, just want to recommend that you get the pomegranate and acai from Warren Brothers. Great for combing out your um, longer-haired dog.